Frank. Hi. All right. Hey. Hi. That waiting song is kind of like being in a club. I was like. Until it begins to boom, 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 boom. Right, right, right. Then it's like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Gio, how are you? I'm good. How you doing? How's my favorite cosmic? I don't want to say girl because that seems so sexist. How's my favorite cosmic intuitive? Oh, uh, I, you know, I'm doing I'm doing well. I'm you know things are stabilizing, slightly chaotic, but you know chaotic chaos within the stability. That's how I like it. <laughs> it feels like I could tell you what it feels like to me. It yeah. feels like good chaos. Yes, yes, yes. Right. That's what it is. That's it's what like it is. Good chaos. Yes, yes. So let's say hi to the people just to start hi. off. Hey, party people. Hey, Nelly, Maria. Oh, see, I can't see them. I'd have to look. I have to look at my phone oh, well, to look see. Oh, phone, girl. They, they let's see. Talk to you. You know, something's gonna come up and they're gonna ask you a question because you know how right. you know how these people are. They they like let's to see. ask. Maria, talking, and only Kiana. B. Butler, Coco Drag. Hey. Somebody says Tracy looks refreshing. Well, actually, the afternoons are my best looks. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't do mornings. And every once in a while, somebody will Zoom with me in the morning, and right. I'd rather die first, right? Yeah. Because that means I got to look all, I got to look a certain way. I'm up. But I gotta look at it. So when right. the person Tracy. does the appointment, if I get a Zoom in the morning, he has to tell me. Right, 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 right. It, you know, I don't do Zoom in the morning. <laughs> I don't right. do it. Right. Because <laughs> I'm like, you know, I'm sorry. You know, maybe I'm missing out on the morning people, but <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Sorry. You don't want me in the morning because I feel like, you know, I can't make heads or tails of this scribble. Did I'm you looking. see did you see what I posted to the group where the little girl said she had a boyfriend, but she had to punch him because she no. said I posted, I think it was this morning. Okay. Go look at all the ones I posted this morning. They're okay. hilarious. I was okay. up like three o'clock. Oh man. And I had nothing to do. I didn't want to turn on TV because I right. knew that would just have me like this. Well, if it's three o'clock for three o'clock for you, okay, that would have been nine o'clock. For you. Right. Six. But six. It's sleep time for me, right? And so right. I was posting all of these reels mm -hmm. from mm -hmm. Instagram. And one of the little girls was like, maybe I didn't get a chance to post it. One of the little girls was like, something about having a boyfriend. And somebody, a guy was asking her a question. He's like, how you got a boyfriend? What happened? I'm mad at him. What happened? Because he called me ugly, ugly, something like that. Oh, no. oh, no. That's how I am in the morning. Ugly. You, do, you, you just reminded me of a dream I had, but go ahead, go ahead. I am ugly in the morning. I, yeah. my mind is good. My psychic abilities, all sharp. Mm -hmm. Ugly in the mornings. You don't want, you don't want to see all this in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> this right here takes hours for my body and my cells. I get it. To start forming, and they're I like, "Okay, Tracy, we could do this." Right. We could do this. That's why I like the dashikis and bonnets. I don't yes. need to look pretty for the dashikis and bonnets. Right, 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 right. Look, borderline ugly. Got okay. And you know what? <laughs> ain't no shame in it. As long as it's just you, you know, let me do my ugly thing. <laughs> <laughs> you know? You know? So, Gio. Yes. I talked about honey this morning. I don't know if you were on. Okay. But I have no. That wasn't on the dashikis and bonnets. I think I saw something. No, I did. I didn't because it took me a while to do my other bag this morning. So yeah, I missed most. Well, of I was doing somebody else's podcast. Yes. Tara. Mm -hmm. Tara. Oh, Stolen. that's what I heard. Okay, that's right. That's the, right. The horse whisperer. Yes. Had me on her show. Right. Right. And so, of course, that was early morning. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I did my best to look presentable. 
-hmm. When I tell you, I put so much white around my eyes. Oh my God. Oh no. <laughs> to, to try and look presentable. Oh. And um, was it, you could um, see it was on, on video? I only heard it on the radio. It, Yes, yes, yes. It is radio okay. form, but, okay. but we were on Zoom. Gotcha. Right, right. And you have to be so looking we, right we, on we Zoom. We could see yes. each other, and then yes. it translates to, right. you know, Shopify. Wait, not Shopify. Whatever. Uh oh, oh iHeartRadio. Whatever. Yeah, all the and I some heart, of them are it, video it translates platforms. To all these. Right. Right. But the I don't think it was video. I think all of it is. We were on video, but all of it was translated just to podcasts. Gotcha. Right, right, right. But you still wanted to look good for her for so, her and Jason. You don't want to show up ugly for them. <laughs> I get it. I can't. Yeah. I can't. Yeah. But I had yeah. I had readings to do this morning. Mm -hmm. I had readings. Right, right, right. And then mm -hmm. straight from the reading I had the podcast. So right. in between of trying to wake up, do the readings, mm -hmm. um, Going straight on the podcast, at some point I didn't put makeup on. Right, right. So I'm literally in one of my readings on my camera, on my camera, uh -huh. mm -hmm. in a reading, mm -hmm. putting on makeup. Yeah. In a reading. Yes. <laughs> Looking at my iPod camera. Like multitasking, <laughs> like you right. can't imagine. Right. Oh, All I know. I'm telling her, you know. <laughs> You don't in worry trouble, about girl. your man. He's a good man. Don't worry. Molly. I'm in trouble, Molly. girl, right? Wait, 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 wait. Molly. See, that's you it. In trouble, girl. You in trouble, girl. You in trouble, girl. you cracked me up. So because I'm doing half ass, I'm reading, mm -hmm. I'm in the mm -hmm. camera, my right. makeup looked a little bit. Out of out of whack to me okay. to me, okay. but yeah. it is what it is, right? I'm not worried about that. But right. as I was putting on the makeup, mm -hmm. one of my makeup said that the name of it was Honey Eighty Five. Ooh! I said this woman, Honey, is showing up all over the place. Mm-hmm. Yes, and it's funny is. because I've had this makeup for months. Like you right. can just get rid of makeup, right? But I'm right. putting it on today in front of, and mm -hmm. I went to show Dashi <laughs> Kids of Bonnets. I went to show yes. it, and I'm like, "Honey, honey." So <laughs> what, what you all don't know is that in our group, in our group, Melissa, who makes the Sugar Daddy candles and herbs and this is her kit this is what she sends out right mm -hmm. had a woman that passed away and this is how the honey herbs came to be mm -hmm. all right we're calling them sugar daddy herbs because the story behind it is honey's talking to melissa and honey is telling melissa you need a sugar daddy right let me right. spotlight this for you mm -hmm. geo goes to clean out her apartment. Mm -hmm. Yep, somebody else because lived she, this here. Is, somebody else yeah. lived there. She's subletting. Right, but, and you people know, acquire and did, apartments get... in strange ways in New York City. So I'm cleaning oh, out yeah, the yeah. apartment. No judgment. This no, person no, no. left everything. No, no. Right, right, right. In New York City, that's mm -hmm. a, that's not even a disclaimer. You don't right. mean, not in New York City. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and, and, the, and the apartment is fabulous, but I'm finding treasure. And last week, because I, I had these on last week when we were talking, I yeah, found yeah, yeah. I found actually I found six of these empty honey jars, and this is after I knew about honey just and everything. Empty, and I was just like, empty. just empty, never been filled. And empty. I'm like, whoa, empty. what? How, what are the what are, what the, are odds? the odds? What are the what? odds? And so, what's happening, everyone? Mm -hmm. is that honey belongs to melissa like melissa mm -hmm. is having full-on conversations with honey mm -hmm. and she started sharing the conversation and yeah. what i love I, I there's so much to say but i've got so much to say and there's just no time to say right. it, but i have all the time in the world <laughs> and then and then i waste time yeah. i waste yeah. time by telling you there's so much there's so time. much to say <laughs> because you got and, the time but you don't yeah. have the time because we 
got to get to it. I don't have oh, time. Oh, girl. But I got we got time. stuff. In my Dear God book, I read the very first page. Because in my very first page of any journal, oh, oh. I literally write to God. And I say to God, what's going on in my life right now? And ooh, could ooh. I please have, could I please, da, da, da. So this particular Dear God journal, the most recent one, I say thank you for letting me be around spiritual, like-minded people. Mm, that's so nice. Because when Melissa started talking to Honey, mm -hmm. and we started confirming with her, she goes, I think Honey's talking to me. And we're like, yep. okay, so what is Honey saying? And because we're spiritual people, we were like, girl, honey is talking to you. Yes. Without a doubt. Yeah. And then there's certain things that just kept coming up and mm -hmm. boom, she was talking to her again. Ultimately, honey led her to make these sugar daddy candles. Right. 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 Yep. And I got mine Here's yesterday. Here's the thing about honey. Yes. Here's the thing about honey. Right after Melissa brings up all this honey thing, I had a cousin that passed away. Her grandkids called her honey. And oh, wow. one, of, one of the daughters posted, right, one of the daughters posted on Facebook and she said, honey, you, you, you had the most grand boys, the most. It's like five of them. Yeah. And when I read it, I was like, Honey, honey, honey's showing up in my yes. life now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then Melissa gave us necklaces from honey. It, you have no idea what's happening. This That's is a mine. necklace. Let me show you a, a solo. Yes. That's yours. This is, show them. This is my, I got it yesterday. Melissa was kind enough. You know, her husband is giving Melissa some of honey's things. And honey, girlfriend had jewelry and her husband was her was her husband, sugar daddy husband. This is something that uh, Melissa gave me and I'm gonna be, uh, and I wanna also thank Honey for sending it my way as well. And um, so I'll be using this when I light my candles and, um, and the herbs and, and do what I, what I do um, uh, for that. So I wanna thank Melissa and Honey and- Oh, shit. I removed her. Oh, I'm sorry, Gio. I'm just a really bad host. She'll come back on. Oh, I did not do that on purpose, I promise you. I'm not evil that way. I was trying to remove her from the solo. Oh, my God. This is my necklace from Honey. All right. I love the Hamsa. Hamsa. All right. I love any Jewish influence. And uh, Honey's Jewish. And it turns out, it turns out that honey or the word honey or something about honey keeps showing up with all of us. It's so weird. Hold on a second. I don't think Gio knows that I kicked her out. Come in. Back in, please. Come back in, please. Well, there, there goes the flu fluidity of all of this. Sorry, guys. Okay, I'll keep talking. So these are Melissa at Tatone on IG. At Tatone on IG. I don't know what her email address is. These are called sugar daddy herbs. And I like to put my herbs on cupcakes. And so this, this was the, she had already given me a batch. This is the last batch. All right. And lo and behold, in synchronicity, the sugar daddy is a blue influence. And in synchronicity, what do you see when I get to the store? Blue icing cupcakes. I've never even seen it before. Let me get Gio back here at the stream. Oh, okay. I was still backstage. <laughs> it was weird. So I, had to, I said, you know, maybe I need to go out and come back. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. 
Okay. Yes, I didn't see you. I just removed you. I'm so sorry. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, you got, uh, oh wait. The other thing before you go uh, before you go on, I also now what do you have? Do you have the, the Melissa Melissa's money that she sends you to? Do you have anything to show? To show? Okay. Yes. So I have to night, burn my money. Go ahead. Right. I'm be burning burning mine too. But so I'm in the I. So okay, I'm in the in the refrigerator. Right, right. Oh, I got mine right here too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so. I, last night I'm going through the freezer, I'm about to, to, to clean out the freezer. And uh, so I'm looking in there and I see just before I'm about to close the freezer, I look and I see like jammed at the bottom of one of the shelves. <laughs> and I'm like, wait a minute. I don't yes. know if you see Bring it it's, closer. It, Bring it okay. closer. Let me see. Bring it, it closer. It, it, it gets a little blurry as you get closer, it's but tell them what it is. It's a chocolate bar. It's called the Million Dollar Bar. And it's been in this refrigerator forever. For a thousand years. <laughs> exactly, since 2017. But I was like, what are the odds? Because Melissa sent me, she also sent me a bunch of, um, a bunch of the same money that you have. And yes. so all of this, you know these, these these money that you're supposed to use with the candles are come is coming my way. I even got some from Destiny because I got her um, her money butter. Oh so yes, the, yes, the yes. Body, the money body butter, and she sent me some of the money too. And I was like, oh, this is so sweet. So I see this, and I go, oh my god, what are the odds? I said, I got the money from Melissa this afternoon, and then this just pops up in the freezer. And you got the listen. Here's, here's, here's what the irony in all of this. Mm -hmm. Like empty honey jars. Nothing. It nothing was ever put in it. They're empty and they're clean. And they all have the label that just says honey that and, and it's shaped honey. like a honey jar, you know. What is Right? I'm wondering if I should just put the honey jars around when I do the candles, just to open up the honey jars and watch them fill up. Say that again. Do what with it? I'm gonna. I don't know if this will work. It's just a, just an it. idea to Let open up all the honey jars, surround the candles that I'm doing, or with the with the empty honey jars. And since it's a sugar daddy spell, I have to watch the honey jars fill up. I like it. I don't it. know what they'll fill up with, but yeah. the idea is the sugar daddy's got to fill up the honey jars. I like I don't, it. it. Or, I don't know, you know, and because it's glass, they, they will uh, enhance the light maybe up with the candles inside the honey jar. how many candles did she send oh one two three four five six seven a week's worth so maybe put a candle in each one and light it light them in the candle i don't know, I don't know. these are all kinds of things it just just came to me but who knows Listen, all kinds of ideas yeah i'm a big fan of mm -hmm keeping one mm -hmm. as a symbol to honey. Okay, yeah, that's good. All right, yes. thank you. Yes. And the others, I would put the herb at, mm -hmm. at the bottom, mm -hmm. the at the bottom, mm -hmm. the candle, mm -hmm. and I would light it. Yes. Okay. Let me tell you what, what else I'm I would I'm digging do. it, I'm Yeah, digging yeah, yeah. It. Let me tell you what else I would do, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Because if you don't want to use all of them all at the same time, you don't have mm -hmm. to, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It just depends upon how messy it gets. It all depends upon you. But you right. can also yeah. take any bottle top, yes. seal it, yeah. add your herbs, put mm -hmm. it down mm -hmm. in the jar, put it down. Why do I feel like I've done that before? Okay, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I did. And I'll then, tell you once what I did. <laughs> light and then light your candle. Okay. And in the, in the honey jar, but this this yeah attach melt attach 
that's a good idea because I don't want it to get into, you know, if, if it with fire lights, I don't want the glass to crack and, and stuff like that. But but that's first a that's a really all, good idea. Yeah. First of all, we're gonna keep all eyes right on our candle. Mm-hmm. So try it with just one and yeah, see how yeah. it works for you. Okay. I will. I will. All eyes. All eyes on mm -hmm. our candle. Always fire safety first. Right. That's right. Yeah. Nothing more than risking. All right. You know. Yeah. We we have a situation here. Yes, we do. The you know, title. Before wait, before we go on. Does this do share screen by any chance? Like no. like if I no, that's all right. That's okay. It's quite all right. I'll, they I'll need to. It's to not. Go to my, but it would right. be nice. Yeah. Go to your what? Yeah. Tell them. Go, go, to, go to, where? to go to my Instagram if we need to. If we need to, because I oh, is it posted up. right now though? Yes. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. All yeah. right, I can. But look, uh, let me let you finish what you were gonna say. I'm sorry to oh. Kanye. I don't mean to Kanye. You. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna let you finish, Casey. <laughs> I'm gonna let you finish. Girl, I don't even remember. I'm wondering if I can get my phone to join mm -hmm. and then I can go over to your Instagram. I'm wondering. I'm going to try it. It's just to see the chart. You don't have to if you don't want to. That's all good in the hood. Yeah, yeah. But oh, my IG uh, my IG is at Geo Valentine. Girl, please. I know your IG. I got to get on StreamYard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So okay. and while you're you doing start, that, you okay. start, yeah, I got, so while I, got you're doing a, that, I got things to do. Uh, one of the things that made me really bond with Tracy, or have I forced the bond with Tracy? Not at I all. Yell and scream at her on Twitter. Tracy, Megan and Harry go get married. Tracy, do you think yes. Obama is going to walk her down the aisle because her father can't go? Yes, I was, I was yes. Like, we had so crazy. much fun trying to figure all that out. That was <laughs> oh, so was, much fun. It was so much fun. So, I think that's, that's yeah. the thing that bonded us. Absolutely. Yeah, because I, yes, I, yes. I was totally being a bug. And I was like, oh, the wedding is this Saturday. You're going to watch it. You're going to watch it. I want to know what's going on. Oh, here comes Oprah. Okay, so this is, here's the thing. I never look at Megan's chart, her astrological chart, compared to the Queen's astrological chart. Mm -hmm. And that's something that you do in astrology. If you want to know, am I compatible with someone or some kind of relationship, uh, right. you want a, a type of, uh, one session counseling about your relationship with anyone or even right. an institution or something. So, right. uh, I've you know, everyone's been talking about her chart, Megan's chart, with Harry's chart, and all the wonderful things, and you know, all those stresses. You know, people just all up and through their relationship. Okay, we've been yes. done that, but now yes. with what's happening, um, with um, with Megan. And the royal family, so it was yesterday that they announced that, oh, oh wait, the family didn't announce it. The way the story came out was Buckingham, where were my hands? Okay. Buckingham Palace yeah. has a beef with her. Yeah. And Buckingham Palace's uh, beef is it's a, it says the royal palace has had a dignity at work policy in place for a number of years and does not and will not tolerate bullying or harassment in the workplace mm -hmm. so now they claim they claim that megan uh forced out several aides or uh, personal assistants. She fired them, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. You know, my answer to them for everything is the punk Prince Andrew. Pedophile. Right. That's the answer 
to, to all of this. this. Yes. So I said to myself, let me let me take a look at um, at her chart with the Queen's chart. And I do that, you know, with the Queen's chart because she's the matriarch of she's the, the kingpin, the queen pin of that entire family, the firm, whatever you want to call them. Yeah. And when I looked at this chart and I said, Oh, wow. yes. look at this. <laughs> look at her connections to the queen. And I think we spoke about this uh, a few times about the person's 12th house being where things are hidden. Or, or you know, traditionally in astrology, your 12th house is the house of hidden enemies. Hidden enemies. Mm. The queen has the gangster Pluto in Megan's 12th house. And it's one of the most volatile, it's one of the most volatile uh, measurements they have together. Okay, okay so, so if there you, you go. go. Right, so if you look to, oops, it's gone. I know, <laughs> right? I'll, I'll get, get it, it back, I'll get it back. I'll I'll get it back. That's okay. Um, uh, Megan has, has, let me get it while we're talking about it, okay. Megan has Mars in her 12th house of hidden enemies. It's not the, really the best place to have Mars, but that's where she has it. But when you get the Queen's Pluto behind that, and it is, it's an exact conjunction. It, and conjunction meaning at the same degree Say, let's say, you know, now I don't, I don't have them actual. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. I do have the numbers in front of me. Um, mm -hmm. Then, Pluto. Okay. Um, oh, wait, let me just explain to people if they're looking at the chart. Megan's planets are in the middle. They're all blue. And Got then, it. On the, then on the outside, the red planets, those are all the queen's planets. So when you look to if you're looking at it uh, let's say the way if you look to the left the first thing that i circled on the left um that is the conjunction they have it's the queen's pluto is conjunct which means it's right next to it in the same degree or within the same uh yes in the same very close area like they're holding hands um uh, uh right next to megan's mars and that is, let's say, Megan's Mars is 11 degrees. Canceling. So you mean this and this? this. Oh, wait, uh, oh, wait, let me look at you. Wait a second. Let's see here. So this and nope, this. Go to, the, look to the left. Right, that. Where all the arrows that. are pointing. Right. So the Got red it. the red planet is Pluto. The blue, yeah. pl uh, the blue planet is Mars. Um, Got and it. let me tell you, if you were in a relationship, if this was a male-female relationship, depending right. on how people are, what their level of, you know, spirituality and, yeah. know, and all that, their status, yeah. and it doesn't even matter sometimes. This is, this is a connection of passion. This is a couple who's having hot, sweaty jungle sex. Mm. <laughs> okay. Or if it's a more volatile relationship, the <sighs> bottom end of the pole could be. It, it can be, it, it, and I'm just going to spit it out. It, it, the, the worst end of it can be sexual assault. Uh, that's so. That's a, that's an aspect you really need to be careful of. Um, if you are, if you like bad boys, if you, you know, if you out there just you want, you got to be careful with so, that. When it's not, I when it's a, not a sexual relationship. Yeah, go ahead. Right, go right, ahead. right, right, right. I, I get, get that. that. But we're not talking about two, two women. women. Yes. One, One we, we know is, is already established, established, very powerful. powerful. Yes. 
The other one has a high potential to be powerful. Tracy, you have to turn down the volume on the iPad all the way down because it's giving an echo. I don't think or, it's... Oh, 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 or, or your I phone. I think it's the phone, but I, I did. did. I did. Oh, okay. It still does a little bit. That's okay. You know what? Keep going. You I are clear, it. actually. You're clear. I'm even clear, though it's but... I'm, I'm sorry, sorry about, about the echo. echo. That's okay. That's okay. Um, um, so you were saying it was about two women, two and one women. is very established. That's the queen. Very, very established, established, very powerful. powerful. Like yes. the one thing mm -hmm. I understood that she understood. Yes. Is the crown's power. Yes. And she respected the, the crown's power. power. Yes. And, and she treated she... the crown like a man. Okay, yes. So that's, that's how she's established, established herself. herself. Yes. Very yes. emotionalist. Right. Are you and talking about Queen Elizabeth when she became queen? Yes, yes, she committed. She committed to, to the crown. Um, to the crown. She committed to the Constitution of yes. Britain to the point yes. where it even, where it even, it not. It, it was like a baseball bat hitting her marriage when she became the queen. She uh, didn't budge. So we, yeah, I'm not, I, I, I would never take away from her the respect that this woman deserves and what she took on from the age of 25 until she, right now she is, she's 95 now, or she, she's going to be 95. Right. So, um, yes, incredible, incredible, you know, respect. But in that also... Respect. Right. The stamina of masculine energy. Yeah. Cut you know, to. I want to say, I want to say, not so much masculine energy as much as authoritative energy. Okay. She is the queen of swords. Okay. I, I, and by, by the way, way yeah. this, this this was, was developed. developed. This, this was, was developed. developed. This, this wasn't, wasn't her. her. I, you know what? I don't know because this is why I say, remember we sort of talked about the law of subsumption. They yeah. use Queen Elizabeth as the symbol yes. for Britain. So, men, but, 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 but Gio, Gio, men, men did, did that. that. Men. Well, let's look at the chart. Let me show you what I'm seeing okay. in the chart. And well, wait, 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 no, 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 no. no. I'm, I'm trying, trying to, to Get, get to, to Megan's potential right. power yes. in comparison right. to, to the queen. queen. Which so, is what this, if, if you what said, yeah, yeah, if you said, if this was a male female, this yeah. would be either hot, passionate yeah. sex, yeah, or sexual, sexual assault. assault, right? So, so if, if we've got, got two women, women yeah, what? What's your perception? My perception is um, with Elizabeth's power, there was another thing I wanted to show you. With, mm -hmm. a, with, with, um, with the queen, a part of how she uses her influence is through popularity. Yeah. And what we see and another place in uh, in the chart comparison, right at Queen Elizabeth's career point in her chart. And I talk about Saturn. Saturn is right next to it. Do you want me to pull it back up? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hold, on. Hold on. Be patient with me, everyone. Mm -hmm. I'm trying. Okay, so as you're bringing it up, I'll talk about you know in in terms of in terms of two women. I'm just thinking of it in terms of power. There's one thing that that stuck that sticks out for me 
which is um, from the very beginning, I'm pretty sure Queen Elizabeth knew this was going to happen. And when I say this is going to happen, the first one of the first rules of power is do not outshine the master. Mm. Let's say it again, people. Do not outshine the master. I don't care if you're white, black, black and black, white and white, whatever. Do not outshine the master. Hold, Hold on, on a second, second Jill. Jill. Yes. Jill. Hold on a second. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry that there's an echo, but I can't fix it. I'm uncomfortable with that. It's not, uncomfortable. No, no. And it's it not is. against you. It's not right, against right. you. Yeah. But, but the, the Akuda Matata mm -hmm. is for the youth to outshine the master. And that's what we see in this next measurement. I'm going to show you. Go for because, it. Because even, and once again, her chart is symbolizing the entire royal family, the firm, the institution. Okay. Right. So when before we were looking at the, the where the arrows were circled, mm -hmm. I want you to go all the way like, down to the bottom. Go to the bottom. Now see those up. Uh, now keep going a little bit more, Tracy. There you go. Those. Okay. Uh -huh. What we see is the planet Uranus. That's Megan's Uranus. It looks like an H there. That's the symbol mm -hmm. for Uranus. Mm -hmm. the, symbol underneath, the symbol underneath it is the planet Saturn. Saturn is tradition. Uranus is all things new. And when you look at that other thing I circled, that's the Midheaven MC. That's yeah, yeah. It's Midheaven. That is her status. That is her career. That is her face to the Who? world. Who? Who? Um, the queen that that thing that says mc right there in that mm -hmm. little circle that's mm -hmm. queen elizabeth's career point that's queen elizabeth's status that saturn right there is mm -hmm. right there at her career point saturn is authority saturn mm -hmm. is the brick wall saturn is the father now the planet uranus that is that h up above it that's from megan's chart Uranus is all things new. Uranus is the media. Uranus is chaos. Uranus is genius. Ooh, Uranus wow, is wow. youth. So when you get those two things together in a chart, these are not people who are going to stay together long. It's the, the, the first big bell when I see that in a chart is they're going to break up. Okay, okay so, so that's a breakup. Let, let me rehash, rehash this. this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The queen, queen is tradition. Yes. Brick wall. Unbendable. Power and structure. Yes. That's the queen. That's the queen. Yes. That's her that's birth chart. Birth chart. That is her birth chart. And that MC, that's the queen's birth chart, too. That's her career. That's, that's her, her career. career. That's she is the, the authority. Is. Yes, yes, that's who yes, she, she is, is that's, that's who she became, became to, to be. be. Yes. So she is well, well within, her, within chart. her chart. Yes, yes. And now. And then the princess, then the comes, princess along. Comes, comes along. Comes along and she brings Uranus there. The queen feels that. It's one of the most sensitive points in the chart. So when, mm, when, mm. Um, when Megan brings her chaotic new ideas, Mm. You media, um, yes, lightning yes. bolts, electricity, intensity yes, 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 to, yes. to that part of Queen Elizabeth's chart. It's it's uncomfortable and it outshines. Mm. When you look at the, the order of the planets, Saturn, you have you have the Sun, Moon, Mercury, Venus, Mars. Jupiter, Saturn. That was as far as we could see with our naked eye. Then the new planets were discovered. Uranus was the first one. It's like, oh, after Saturn, there's more? Yes, brand new. It's, it's outside of tradition. When you have those two planets together, the, the new things, the, the new always beats out the old. 
this is what the queen is feeling. She, just as much as that, you know, in Britain and, and anywhere, they use the media to, to, communicate. Show, to, get their, to communicate, get their message out. We're seeing yeah. once again, a battle royale in the media right now. Megan took out the big guns. In the United States, who is the new Walter Winchell? Who is the new Walter Con Con Concrete? Oprah Winfrey. They, uh, Oprah, when, is, uh, when, is that, when is that interview supposed to come out? And they know weekend. it. Right. So, so let me get let me something, get something straight. straight. I just want to hear something. I just want to hear something. What planet, what is, planet this? is this? Uh, oh, that is the planet Uranus. That's your run. That's your run. That's correct. And that's and Megan. That's Megan. That's correct. And the and one, the in, the one red in the is red what? is what? That's Saturn. So Uranus so and Saturn. Saturn. And that's, and that's, that's the, queen. the queen. That's correct. And we know from being in Uranus and Taurus. From being in Uranus and Taurus. That Uranus. Uranus. Great. Great. Sh shaking things shaking up, things up. Breaks, breaks down, down the norm. The norm. That's right. breaks, breaks down, down an old, an old system, system that, no, that longer no longer works. Works. Bingo. Damn. Damn. Now, when you talk about, it's also that that mid heaven right there. The yeah, that part yeah. of uh, the chart for Queen Elizabeth. Mm -hmm, that mm -hmm. is, it's a publicity point also in our mm -hmm. charts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And yeah. with Megan's Uranus there, Uranus rules the media. Got it. Got it. And notice how now the way that uh, the way that the Queen's chart, where that Saturn is, still in that circle, for the Queen. Saturn is right behind the line. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, I see Megan, it. Megan, oh, Uranus is oh. right on and in front of the line. Okay, okay. that makes so much sense. Makes so much sense. Because, because the queen, the queen didn't always didn't use always the media, use the media, to, media to, her to her advantage. Right. And she she did at some point start because all the media did was she had to right. No, wait a second. No, wait a her second. Husband her husband made her. made her. Right. Right. That's right. She That's wasn't right. going she wasn't to. Going she didn't to. get mm -hmm. it. She didn't get it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But Megan, but Megan came, mm -hmm. in came in mm -hmm. as a star. As a star. Right. A shining star. Uh, you hello, do uh, not hello. outshine the master. Uh, uh. Saturn also rules mastery. That's when you're, it's concrete. When your skills become concrete, that's because of Saturn. Saturn is a drill, is the drill sergeant. It's the teacher that makes you repeat and repeat and repeat and repeat and repeat mm -hmm. until you've got it down in your head, in your hands, in your heart. In your heart. So, um, you know, the queen could have used it, and I think she tried for like five minutes to use it. Uranus and and um, and Aquarius, they, they, they go hand in hand, um, tried to use it to show diversity. Is that better, guys? That better, guys? I hear crunching, but I, I don't know. know. Like somebody, I know. Eating, like somebody's but eating, but I'm not. I've turned down every turned audio, down every source. audio source. Can I take this can down? Take this yeah, down? you can take it down. Oh, wait, 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 before you, you do, one you, last thing. One last thing. Tell me. Tell me. And then you can tell us about the shoot. Oh, okay. I want to. I want to put your. Um, bring your attention to two other things that I circled. One, okay, remember when we were up at the left with the Pluto and the Mars where the air arrows are, Tracy? Here? Here? Yes. Okay, go down one more and we see, go one more circle down. Okay, do you see the sun and the moon there? 
I see the sun, I see the sun and the moon, yeah. The sun is Megan's, the moon is um is the queen's. That is that is the absolute that's the epitome of relationship. The sun my god, my god, opposites. But but that's where they resonate in Leo. Leo is about dramatic popularity and it is about um gaining recognition the moon is what we need the yes. queen yes. needs to have recognition but the sun the sun is the fuel it's the jet fuel when you look and you see a, a, a jet turn on and that plane goes mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that's Megan. Mm-hmm. she's the star okay. Okay, slow down. Slow down. Whose son, son is in Leo? Is in Leo. Megan. Whose moon, Who's is, moon in is in Leo? Is in Leo. The queen. Damn. Damn. That's heavy. That's heavy. Wow. wow. Last but not least, go down one more past past this where I circled the sun and the moon you go go down to like there's a long circle right there right there that's Venus right oh no a little bit go back up a little bit to the oh, yeah there we go that's Megan's Venus and follow the red line up that's the Queen's Venus they have an exact Venus Venus opposition so with an exact Venus Venus opposition, it is not without affection, but they love differently. Mm. Mm. If anything, the queen loves in a more poetic manner. Megan loves in a more practical manner. Mm. And last but not la- another, mm. this will be the last but not least. When I go to the next set of bubbles where there's a whole bunch of planets there or symbols there and it's exactly opposite the queen's mercury if you follow the red line all the way up there's the queen's mm-hmm. mercury mm-hmm. um all of those planets it suggests that she and megan they can they can talk head to head but with the queen's um the queen's mercury in aries she thinks quickly she speaks quickly um she's the number one communicator but Megan's got her own, uh, on the opposite end, there is tension with all of those planets there. It is Megan's Mars, uh, excuse me, Megan's Saturn in particular, within that group. It's all about politics there and fairness mm-hmm. down there. And it is, it, it creates tension with the queen's mind. So um, she can, they, they probably debate, they probably argue. She may sometimes try to teach the queen, or she thinks yep. she's teaching the queen. Yeah, yep. I can see that. Um, yeah, I can see and, that. And the queen may be open to it, but it's, it's almost like, you know what? No, no, I, I am the queen. You don't teach mm-hmm. me. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. right now, this thing, all I want to say, yeah, I kind of want to say to the royal family, they don't want this smoke. You don't want that smoke? You don't want that smoke? No. When this, when, when they're trying to get all this done, they, and even, I even saw a story where this, where, where I'm watching British, British uh, media also, and they're saying, uh, it's a, Meghan and Harry, are thinking about not showing the not broadcasting the uh the interview and i'm like uh no that's not what we're hearing mm. over in america right. what we're hearing is they right. can't wait and this is like you ever see you have a tarot card of, and i don't even know which tarot card it is but it's a woman sitting in a seat and she's kind of like this and you ever see do you see those those previews of Megan and Oprah, and Megan. I saw, I saw the way the she, way was, she sitting. was sitting. I I noticed I, that. I Gio. noticed that to you. She's 
pregnant and the way her breasts are sitting a certain way. But there's a style to it. There's a style of defiance. defiance. Yes. You can, you know, Control. you can take the chart Control. down now. Yeah, yeah. You can take the chart down because it's, yeah. Okay, okay. Go ahead. Let me just, let me just, let me just get, there's a, there's a. Let me just, no, it's still here. All right. Oh, remove. Yeah, you can take it. There you go. Echo gone. <laughs> Echo gone. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. There's a style mm -hmm. to the way she is sitting has nothing to do with the baby. She is making a statement. Her eyes, her eyes are intense and the way her hands i noticed her hands around her mm. face at some point i was like oh really? mm. this is intentional this interview this is intentional she is going after the firm because there's something undercover that they did them wrong. And the way they're going to spin it when they get ready is to throw them under the bus. So this is calculated. You are good. The public is going to know. So let me ask you another question. Uh -huh. What's their rising? What's their right? What's their ascendant? They're rising, both of them. Uh, okay, let me. Uh, let, yeah, I, I still have their chart up here. Tell me what their okay. rising is, and tell me what Ascend their Mars um, is. Um, Megan's ascendant is Cancer. That's her rising. I saw the that. Okay. Yeah. And the Queen's ascendant is. Um, Oh, Capricorn. And Got they are it. close enough. So it's almost like one one's chart is upside down, the other person's chart is upside down. That's there's also, so much it's, opposite there's, there's so going many on. karmic connections with them. Yes, so much opposite. Or oh, close mm -hmm. to opposite. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. This is yeah. Capricorn and Cancer. Mm -hmm. They're. Okay. Not opposite in a bad way. No, no, but, no. But opposite in their mm -hmm. thinking way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like I'm opposite Aquarius. Mm hmm But ironically, I get along with Aquarius because I understand their style. Right. If you consider it like when you we say opposite, let me, mm -hmm. let me get you when you say think of it as like your chart is really this it's a cert it's an orb so oh, okay. let's say you have your rising the line it goes all the way around it's your first yeah. house and your second house aries is also libra cancer yes. cancer is also capricorn yes is also aquarius yes it's bands going I, around i get it because that's so and we that's get we tend right. to get along like most people right. that don't understand Gemini's, yes. a Sagittarian likes Gemini's. Right, exactly. They're pulling from they're pulling from certain. Sometimes they call it the Sagittarius is the higher octave of Gemini. Uh, Aquarius is the higher octave of Leo, and uh, Libra is the higher octave of Aries. That kind of thing. So are they, you they, saying that because they're air first? No, not necessarily because of air. It's just the way, the, um, psychologically, the way the, the, the symbols have been painted. And, Got it. Um, so, you know, uh, Libra is a little more gentle than Aries. Um, Much more you, gentle. Yeah, you've got you've got Taurus, which is super stubborn. But it's opposite Libra Scorpio. and Gemini will appreciate each other's humor. Right, because they're air, exactly. Um, yeah, that's how yeah. they, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it's, 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 it's so much. <laughs> so, with all that mm -hmm. being said, where mm -hmm. are their Mars? I'm curious. Because that's um, the fighting planet, so I want to know. Well, that was the thing, is that 
queen has forced Meghan to fight. The queen got gangster on her Mars. Ooh. She really, and, and because Meghan's Mars rules her own midheaven, and when you have her midheaven is Aries, that's your career point. Mm. So what's happening is when when uh, the Queen's Pluto, which is like the godfather, is mm. on Meghan's Mars, mm. it is pressuring her Mars to show off what she can do, what career wise, what Meghan Make can it. do career wise. Yes. And, mm. and what Megan can do career-wise, she's the manager. Aries is number one. Her midheaven is number one. Mm. Queen is pushing her to show, you want to see what I can, this is what, watch how I manage this. You see how mm. I managed to get out from under your thumb? Did you see how I did that? It was, it was, it so was brilliant. <laughs> it, no, no, it was brilliant. And then, like a bold bitch, she went back because she was committed to a ceremony. She went back in the land. She, yes, yeah, she was trying to show. Listen, <laughs> no hard feelings, and they were like, Poo. But it was beautiful when she went back. And what color did she wear? What color? I found that mistaken. It was red. Yeah, she wore that cape. That cape number. Oh. oh statement 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 she was Never fighting know. she was fighting and she went back in she went back in the jungle to fight she yes. went back in to show them in not red. only am i leaving, in red not Mars. only am i leaving i'm yes. coming back and facing you yeah i'm not afraid of you that's right mm -hmm. it was beautiful Meanwhile, yeah. I'm like this. I'm like this to the TV screen. Right. Oh my God. Oh my God. All the while, praying. The popcorn. <laughs> right. Popcorn, praying, praying, because I could tell what she's doing. They were not going to Dianaize her. No. Can I, can I just make, make a point when you mentioned Diana? Yes. Please remember people. When Megan married Harry, she was the same age that Diane. That's me. Oh, that's okay. No, no, I, I like every sound that comes through. It's, it's, it's validation. A sign. It's, a, it's a sign. It's a sign when, validation. Right. It's a sign. So when Megan married Harry, uh, Megan married Harry, Megan was the same age that Diana was when she died. This was not a baby who married Harry. Mm. Wow. She was not a she was not a 19 year old girl like Diana was when they first manipulated Diana. It's Megan it's, was 36 years old when she married Harry. Grown woman with her own businesses. Yeah. Already an established actress in the television industry. Yeah. Already a philanthropist going to foreign countries Africa, from a child. India, on yes, her own already, before right, she already. ever met Harry. She didn't know. Right. Right. So this right. is not a woman that you can easily squash. She was not a teenager when she married him. She was a grown woman. And that's why they did not want her to marry him. She already had a marriage. So this woman is wise about relationships, the good, the bad, and for real. It is this reality in this generation. People get married, the relationships end. They divorce, they get remarried. It is no, no longer a stigma or something to be ashamed of. This but is remember, the world they're still right. But remember, that's something mm -hmm. still the crown had to overcome. Bingo. They still haven't overcome it. Because of the Saturn <laughs> in their right. tradition. Right. She is the first, but... She smat smithereens right. that concept. And notice how, you know, where our folk, according to tradition, our focus right now is supposed to be on the queen and Philip, because Philip is recovering from heart surgery. And second, our focus is supposed to be on William and Kate. 
it hasn't been. Anybody heard anything about William and Kate recently? It hasn't been. That is a grave sin to not have your focus on the queen, the current queen, and the and the the king. Or, or wait, better yet, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Notice how I just totally skipped over Charles. That was a grave sin because oh, Charles is supposed to be the king. Whether we, whether Ever he's going to be or not. Charles. Yeah. Whoever brings him up, he is such a mute point. And he shouldn't be. That's the crime. That's According not to Megan's. Them. That's not Megan's problem. That's right. the queen's problem. Bingo. The queen made it possible for all of us to forget Charles. Yeah. I didn't even talk about the transits in the Queen's chart, and I'm not going to because this was about focusing on her and Megan right now. Yeah. But, uh, you know. Oh, everybody's telling me it was green. Thank you, sweeties. They're saying it was green. Okay. Oh, her outfit was green. Her outfit she went was back. green. I that think it was a she... cape. I think it was a cape still. But wasn't there an outfit she had on that was red there? Because people were talking there, about yeah. there was something here with she Megan in red. Function and she had on the red cape and the red dress and, and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but um, yeah, green, green is the heart chakra. She was coming back, you know what? I still got love if you're willing to get along. I still got the love. And they did it. She was like Never mind. Never mind. Yeah. So, to, as of today, March 5th, mm -hmm. 153 p.m., a mm -hmm. judge has ruled mm -hmm. that Meghan Markle is to receive a front page apology from the UK tabloid. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. <laughs> how perfect is the timing in all of this? Now, yeah. that's big news over there. That's big news. Once again, the crown is being overshadowed. That's right. The firm, right. the mm -hmm. firm is being overshadowed. This was just announced. And a British judge ruled Friday, today, mm -hmm. that an mm -hmm. apology must appear mm -hmm. in the mail uh the mail is um the tabloid yes daily mail the daily mail right on sunday let's see what they do and on the <laughs> home page on the yes. home page of mail online website twice good okay when is megan's interview isn't it sunday or saturday when is it Oh gosh, no! Wait, let me see. Is it, it's what this is it? weekend. Fifteenth. What? Is it? it is this weekend. Yes. Is it or is it March fifteenth? Because wait, I'm so March fifteenth. Let's see. I'm loving this judge right now. Yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, but wait, wait, wait. Queen Elizabeth unexpectedly gets two new corgis to keep her company at Windsor Castle. She's never going back to to she's never going back to the other castle. She already said no. She's it. always hated that castle. I don't blame she, her. She, she said, said it's cold. Yeah. She said she's never going back. Yeah. yeah. She just didn't know that she had the power to say, "I don't right. want to live in that castle." Right. Right. Exactly. It's oh 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 wait. Kate Middleton and Prince William speak with parents. His son was saved by the Royals crisis text line. People what magazine. Is this interview. Lord. And why do I think it's the fifth? No, day? which airs on CBS Sunday. This Sunday? I okay. think so. On six on airs on CBS. I believe it's on oh, 60 you know, minutes. Google's been listening to me all day. They all I have is Royal Family News. Carol Middleton I, confirms I, daughter Pippa's second pregnancy. Oh, how nice. I think it's on Sunday mm -hmm. on 60 Minutes. Wait, okay, I'm going to say, wait. I'm going to ask Siri. <laughs> Let's see. Hey. Do you guys know? 
Siri, when is the next Oprah Winfrey interview with Meghan Markle and Harry? Ah, okay. When is when is it, and how to watch? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Sunday, March seventh. See, there you go. And how to watch? Let's, well, tell me how to watch it, Siri. You said you're saying sixty that. minutes. Oh, oh, on sixty minutes for real? For I real? Think for so. real? I think so. Oh, see, yeah, on CBS on Sunday. That is, oh yes, from eight o'clock to 10 p.m. Oh, they're gonna drag it out Michael Jackson style. I shouldn't say, I don't wanna bring up Oprah and Michael, but but you know what? I, I have to go off and be a big For girl. two the hours? Big you, know, two gonna, you know what they're gonna do? Hour event? Oh, hell yes, go ahead, Oprah. I ain't even feeling her these days, but I gotta say, go ahead, Oprah. Listen to me, I might have to watch that live. I, I will be watching, yeah, yeah. No, I mean live. I might have to watch that with my people. Yeah. Oh, please do, because you know, I'm like, oh, I haven't been doing TV and I don't really have one around me. I don't go in the other room with the TV and I don't <gasps> have my own in here. So yeah, oh, no, let's no, no, watch no. it together. Now we, we, okay, but what I gave, just so you guys know, I gave you the East Coast uh, time. That's the East Coast time. So yes, yes. Do you, what, 8 p.m. Do you, 8 p.m. What do you do oh. in Los Angeles? Does it come on at, at 8 p.m.? I'll watch yeah. it with you. I'll watch it with you because, like I said, I don't have TV here. So it'll be 11 o'clock for me. Let me see which one mm -hmm. am I streaming. Okay. Uh, I wonder if I can get it streaming CPS East Coast time. I, I, I'll, okay. I'll figure it out. Okay. So now. Okay. Should I watch it on Periscope, which tends to be the easiest? It, yeah, yeah. Periscope is fine? Yeah. I get Periscope. I do Periscope. Are you guys okay with watching it with me on Periscope? We'll do Periscope. Because this is going to be the last of Periscope anyway. Right, right. I'm going to miss Periscope. Wait, wait, they're going to do it different. That's the thing. It's not going to be, I think they it's going to be really separate. announced. I haven't really I announced like what they're doing. I, I know. Like you know what the problem is? I lose yeah. all that content. All my uh, content. I lose everything. Really? They don't all give my you a archives. Chance. They don't give you a chance? They were always my backup if YouTube right. messed up. I used to watch you on Periscope. I didn't mm -hmm. watch you on YouTube. And then mm -hmm. at some point I got it. I was like, oh, you know what? I should watch you on YouTube. You know, to give you the, the likes and the, uh, you know, so they can see people in the numbers. So and, we'll watch it on Periscope together, but I'm going to okay. find out if I can get it Easter. Okay. okay. All right. I'll make yeah. an announcement. So, guys, mm -hmm. for right now, let's watch uh, the 60 minute special at 8 p.m. Mm -hmm. The Oprah interview with Megan and Harry. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm on periscope right right periscope. well maria listen let, let me tell you about uranus and her powerful uranus mm -hmm. that megan has in her mm -hmm. and the fact that we are in uranus and taurus what sign is her uranus in her uh let me look, 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 look. um her her uranus is in scorpio oh my god and so it's opposite Taurus. Uh, let me see what, and who's, what number. And who's Uranus is in Taurus? Oh, look at this. Um, well, you know what? No, there's nothing. The queen has her son in Taurus. The queen's son is at zero degrees Taurus. I know in the Got chart it. it looks like it's in Aries. It is not. It is Got it. at zero degrees Taurus. Got it. However, um, let me just see what Megan is. Megan's 26. Right now, interesting monster must have an interesting area. Let me just I, I, let me. I gotta. You pull keep up. talking. I gotta go to the bathroom. But you look okay, it up ahead. and you keep talking. Don't wait. For I me. will keep talking. I won't. I won't let the people go. I can't see your comments, but you know, keep I on talking. Keep what talking. I'm what I'm checking for right now. I'm looking at the chart of the moment. 
And I need to see where the planet, the exact number of where the planet Uranus is now. Let's make this a little bit larger. Uh, larger, larger. So I can read what the, now this is a little different. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So this has been going on for a whole, not yet. Wait. Okay. 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 So I think I may be wrong what, uh, what Tracy is, is um, looking for. But, but long story short, that band between Scorpio, Scorpio and Taurus are opposite. Taurus and Scorpio. They are opposite each other. And um, and it's and it's just it's charged for them right now. Even though Uranus already went over the Queen's uh, the Queen's son when it first entered Taurus, um, you know, the, the sign is still charged. So sh she's going through changes. And Uranus is actually shining on Scorpio. If you think of it, it's you know, it's exactly opposite Scorpio. So it's, you know, it's shaking up all things Taurus, all things Scorpio, and the squares of it also, um, Leo and Aquarius. So that, uh, those four signs are, they are experiencing, they're experiencing a certain amount of chaos, a certain amount of all things new, shakeups, electricity, a, a kind of inspiration, flashes, flashes of insight. So, you know, people who are psychic, people who are ruled by Uranus, they're the ones who get that flash of insight. It doesn't just kind of, like, they don't have the Neptune cloud <laughs> that they download from. Their downloads come like, <laughs> <laughs> so that's how, that's how that works. But uh, you were mentioning you were talking about there was something you wanted to say, Tracy, about uh, about Uranus uh, in Taurus. Oh, I was telling you that the, the queen is a Taurus at zero degrees. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So, 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 mm -hmm. how many times have I told Tauruses they don't want to listen to me, Gio? Right. They don't yeah. want to listen. Hey, even they, I didn't want to listen. Even I didn't want to listen. <laughs> <laughs> no. People say to me, oh, you talk about Taurus because you had a lover and he dumped you. They say that to me. They are so mean. So they mean. are. They are. Be mean people. Be mean, right? Okay. Right. And I'm like, no, no, no. Uranus <laughs> is in Taurus. Right, right. Taurus are rigid. Yeah. The queen is rigid. It's a fixed sign. Mm -hmm. Brick wall, brick wall, people, brick wall, brick wall. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If anything, they'll just make the wall thicker. They'll build a wall. Right, right. Anything to not let change occur. Right, right. Universally, what has Uranus and Taurus done? It's closed down schools. It's opened up awareness to nursing homes all over the world. In Jerusalem, same thing. Nursing homes were the first to get attacked. That system is disgustingly off, right? Mm -hmm. um, we found out people don't wash their hands. Mm -hmm. uh, Uranus wanted people to shut the F up. So mm -hmm. what did he do? He said, wear a mask. Shut up. Mm-hmm. Listen, wear a mask, right? So many changes. And Uranus ain't done, honey. Uranus and Taurus ain't done. What what other areas is it gonna attack to you? I know well, money it's still, money. It's changing the financial industry. Taurus is uh, oh uh, <laughs> real estate is real estate is Taurus's it's jam. It's about to go Banking down. Is Taurus's jam. Credit <laughs> okay. card. Credit card. Rest Restaurant industry. That oh, is food. Food. Damn. Taurus is up to eat. Food, food, food. Why? 
why is yes. the restaurant industry being taken down? Because they don't pay the Mexicans that work in the back that cut up your onions that you're eating. Hello. It's not about who I dated, people. Mm -hmm. This is a universal issue. It's not about mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. It's about you. Especially and it's about real estate. Oh my goodness. In the business real estate. Oh. The business real estate oh my in, God. Uh, in New York working. City. Commercial real no, no. estate. Nobody's working in the big buildings. And guess what's going to happen? So now they're going to be like, hey, we can start going mm -hmm. back and doing normal mm -hmm. things. But businesses are going to be like, no we and like you know our i can i can even tell you from home for me i'm that person who you know I, i'm a little curmudgeon i'm a curmud curmud only I, I can't wait to be an old lady curmudgeon i can't wait i will not i, I did not to ever, let you be that you will, it will not happen <laughs> but you know what i did was i um uh, with, with with the banking and all of that i refused to go digital just yeah. like now I'm acting like an old lady on Instagram like because I don't know how to use it because there's certain things like I don't have a Facebook. I never got one. I'm that person who's like, once they call face, once they call my space, I ain't going to that Facebook. It's no fun. <laughs> but, but, but it's interesting that you never went to Facebook because mm -hmm. to be honest with you, mm -hmm. Facebook was responsible for the downfall of American ideology. Facebook made racism more prominent but when it first i remember when it first came it was kind of like it was the thing that they marketed on was their was its exclusivity the only people yes who had facebook or could have facebook was harvard yale princeton stanford and then yes. slowly oh and then it became cambridge oxford uh and yes. so it was like ooh. If I get on this Facebook, maybe I can find myself a rich husband, a sugar daddy. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Most women went to college only to find a man, not to have mm -hmm. a career. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. The majority of women. Right. So Facebook came to friend place, mm -hmm. the first mm -hmm. dating site, actually. Right. 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 Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. And so mm -hmm. go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. And so, I'm waiting um, for you. I wasn't interested that because I'm an artist, I wanted to be able to control my own page, put colors and decorate it like you used to be able to with MySpace. And Facebook was like, this is plain white page. And I was like, this is boring. And then it's like, oh, if my mother and my aunts can be on it. I don't want to be on it. I want to be on a hip site, you know. But now I'm coming back because, you know, uh, and it's been a long time. I didn't, haven't realized it's been since like 2000. Three two thousand four. It's about two thousand four when Facebook uh, when Facebook showed up, and mm -hmm. um, and I just didn't want any part of it because I didn't like Mark Zucker. I didn't like what I thought was going to happen. If everything I thought was going to happen has happened. Yeah. So um, so I'm not on Facebook, but I know I realize that Facebook owns Instagram. But okay, Uranus and Taurus. It once. The, the, the pandemic came along and I said, okay, you know what, people, we don't know what this thing is yet. We don't uh -uh. know if it's, if it's blowing in the streets. We don't know if you can, you know, on a touch screen or you touch money. Yeah. It's like, you know what, I got to yeah. start banking. I got to start paying with my phone or with my, you know, the chips on my credit card, what have you. It made me switch. That was a big change for me. Uranus and Taurus, you had to switch. That was that's you had to conform. Yeah. You had to conform. And I was and like, you know what? So Big Brother's gonna watch me. You know what? I don't. I, I hate it. I hate it. But if that's that's the majority, you know, what am I gonna go live out in the woods? I ain't ready to do that. So I guess Big Brother got me to a certain extent, you know. But um, you know, so I so I just won't walk naked around my house anymore. I just won't talk about. <laughs> I won't. I don't talk to all my political spies anymore. I just gotta stop. <laughs> but here's the thing. So the queen mm -hmm. is a Taurus. The queen, right up until this day, mm -hmm. is not bending. 
She is I'm, not bending. While you're talking, I'm just going to look and see when uh, when Uranus rolled over the Queen's. I think mm -hmm. was it 2018 when they they married in 2018. Mm -hmm. okay. I'll let you. Do, I'm. I'm. I'm gonna let you finish. <laughs> wasn't wasn't that when Uranus went direct in 2018? It was about two oh, years when ago. It, when it when it when it entered. Uh, when it entered, that's what I'm trying to find out. I'm trying to it, find it out. Entered it entered at first. I thought in Aries. No. Oh no. It went retrograde for a minute in Aries. Right. It went actually. It went into Taurus and then retrograded out back into Aries. The Aries and then it went in. So that means it played ping pong with her son, which is at zero degrees Taurus. So I just want to uh, see, I need to look at the date. I'm wondering if that's when Harry, uh, if that's when Harry met Megan, uh, if that is when I got to Tell me, tell me, dates. tell Ooh. me, I need to know. Okay, let's see. Let's bring it to the date. I'm just going to bring up, I'm, I'm going to bring up January 1st of 2018, just, just so I know. January 1st of 2018, Uranus, where are you? Yeah, thinking? you keep, no matter how you feel about Oprah. Right, right. She is being part of a systematic change. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't matter how you feel about Oprah, what mm -hmm. matters is that she has an amazing platform mm -hmm. that is allowing Megan to talk. Mm -hmm. Remember yeah. that. As I'm looking now, January. You know 1st. what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. it doesn't matter at this stage of the game. What mm -hmm. matters is who else was going to let Megan talk? Right. Powerful. Who was going to okay. lend that over to her the way she can interview? Mm -hmm. Think about it. Who out there in the ether can do this? Only Oprah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so I'm seeing. And she might be paying off some karmic debt, by the way. Like right, right. spiritually, right? Spiritually, yes. mm -hmm. I throw my hands up. I'm yeah. not in judgment. I think she might be, you know, depositing some karmic debt. Mm -hmm. I'll take that. I'll take yeah. that. Oh, yeah. I will take that. Yeah. And, um, and, and just so you know, I find I finally got to it on the uh, Jan. Oh, wait. How did it come up June? Well, that makes sense. That makes even more sense. Woo. Okay. June 1st of 2018. That's just two weeks after Megan and Harry, about a week and a half after Megan and Harry got married. So tell me what your correlation planet, is, what's going planet, on here? The planet Uranus was right on the queen's sun. At it the time? At zero degrees, yes. Is that at zero? the time? At the time that they got married. So this is a new, brand new person. Uh. She's receiving shocks to her son to her fuel and not not that it was you know i'm not saying it was a bad thing i'm no, saying no, it's not a bad right, thing but right, look at yeah. megan's wedding yes yeah that it infused new energy a new kind of once again there's a there look is at, a look humanitarian at feeling to uranus there's there's new energy there's there's you know this is like Which a is new british, this, right this is a new british family we are more humanitarian than you you know think that we are we're not we're not racist look at, look, <laughs> well that's well that's what you think well the megan's that not you're though, but megan's not they might have that's not what i meant this is on this is on the queen's son right this is but, this is but what i'm the saying same, is she mm -hmm. might have pretended she might have showed faith as if she was not racist. I don't think she was pretending. Neptune would have been her pretending. It might have been just the, the, the fact that, oh, our luck, instant, because that changes your, Uranus is also a luck changer instantly. It changes your luck. It could have been like, aren't we lucky to have this new, fresh, young, 
base. But she liked base her of in the humanitarian, Right, right. So that's but what I mean. Also, the face of humanitarianism no, but she is in our lives. she liked Diana in the beginning. That's true. Yeah, well, they liked Diana because they thought, you know, Charles liked her. They didn't know that she was... Oh, that's true. But wait a second. So with the Uranus matching up that way, here you yeah. had a young lady that mm -hmm. did not have a Kate wedding. She walked uh, down the aisle by herself. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She had a black choir. Yes. A black pastor. Right. You know? And you know, here's the thing. Don't, don't, don't forget that the queen is not, she's not new to black people. Yeah, no, she's she in Africa every other, every other week. Well, you know, but I'm not buying that Africa. Hold on. Not right. buying that Africa bullshit. I'm just but saying she's not. They are solely responsible for apartheid. I'm not, I'm not taking that away. I'm not Sorry. taking that away. I'm yeah, just yeah. saying for people who think that this is the first time she saw a black person, that's not true. <laughs> no, 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 no. But her right. perception of, mm -hmm. of that is from an is from a state of mm -hmm. service servitude. No, no she, she has to she has to deal with power. African when I say deal, I didn't mean to say deal. She she has she socializes with black kings and queens. They come to uh, black royalty comes to England quite frequently. She mm -hmm. um she and and you know what? let me get let me get something straight. This so, is so. all kind of like fantasy realm or else we wouldn't be talking about them we'd be like let's go get them <laughs> because mm, that's really that's true. True. yeah yeah so, i agree so that's like if we go go there uh-oh we go wait if i was to go there and say megan why <laughs> well here's why? the thing lottie lottie says everyone i know in uk i knew were very happy to see megan and harry get married love and right. everyone no we were we were with you we were oh all yeah why and when did it turn? When did the tabloids get permission mm -hmm. to attack her? We agree with you. We were fanatics for the way. You, know you know what it was? You know what it was? We, we, our focus was taken away from the whole Brexit. Brexit, the whole Brexit thing mm. began before yeah. Trump got into office. I didn't yes. think that it happened. No, it did. happened 2015 it did. It did. or 2016. Way before right. Trump got right. into office. Right. Right. And then it started to happen here with Trump. Remember, it was like a twinning. Mm -hmm. It was a twinning I remember. thing between Boris and Trump. Well, it was they just before like, Boris, though. It was just right. before Boris. Remember the guy, the, the woman. Oh, oh Boris, Elaine May. Down. Not just, Elaine May. <laughs> what is her name? Elaine. I don't um, remember, but yeah, right, the the, fe the female uh, prime minister, right? Yeah. So yes, what yes, happened yes. is this element of of uh, of right wing. It wasn't just happening in the United States. It began to take over in Britain as well. As a matter of fact, it started there first, and then it started with us. So we stopped paying strict attention. I paid a little bit of attention, but it's a little uh, stopped paying strict attention. And there was the, the 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 international white supremacy movement. It wasn't just here in America. It's happening over there too. So it's the same as like notice how they're going whole they're going hard on Cuomo right now. They're doing it the same way that they did with Al Franklin. That um and and it was the same thing going on over there as it was over here. So I do believe she was happy to see this happen. But the press, remember, the press has, has been infiltrated on their side and on our side. We have yeah. Fox News. I don't know what it would be like on that side, but but the, the press there, is, in terms of gossip, is a whole lot more, if you can imagine, a whole lot more toxic than it is here Very in the United toxic. States. So, yeah, yeah. Um, so they really, they really came down hard on her, and um, you know, Brexit just like Harry. Brexit, Brexit started with, if I'm not mistaken, guys, you guys let me know with David mm -hmm. Cameron. Um, it did. Theresa May took it over because he still couldn't get it solidified, Cameron. 
Okay, okay. That I wasn't paying attention at Teresa the time, so May yeah. took it over and mm -hmm. she couldn't get it solidified. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And at some point right. okay, there was some that. weird vote with Brexit. Yeah. There was some mm -hmm. weird vote and, yes. they, and they didn't vote her way. And that's not a bad thing, but right, right. It, like it at that point she was like, I'm out. I well, see I, 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 one of my one of my best friends it lives over in um lives in London. And I remember her getting really upset and, and starting to organize with other mothers through her son's school. They were sending permission slips home. You know, we call them permission slips in form home saying, tell us what your background is. And she said, oh, hell no. Don't anybody fill out this form. And she began to tell all of her son's, uh, all of her son's parents that she knew don't fill out this form and that became a big deal but it's no one's business what our background is right and um and i remember she 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 tweeted me when um when they started voting about brexit and whether it should be a thing and she was devastated when the vote came back that uh that people were in support of it yeah and she she was just as shocked as we were that trump was elected so that's why we also need to get into the whole election thing about whether ele we don't need to do it now but that um whether elections were fixed and why these attitudes changed all of a sudden yeah. and you know the other the other countries uh in europe eastern europe that <clears throat> that uh, putin got a hold of it, it just was trickled down as in trying to get well, I have something to say here. Sure. Uh, we're getting off topic, but that's okay. <laughs> um, let me see if I can find it. Maria says they want to remove Cuomo so a new governor could pardon. Thank you, Maria. Trump. Yes, absolutely true. Absolutely, Absolutely. And, you know, and don't be misled by the Democrats who are also like, yes, we have to get this done. We have to get this done. Because, you know, they want to play their power games, too. They want who they want in there as well. I mean, how long was, I think, I think um, Mario Cuomo was in office for 20 years. Yeah. I grew up with Mario Cuomo. Right, right. So yeah. they're like, what, what if Andrew's in there for 20 years? First of all, we're not, you know. You know, I, I don't own anything in New York City. I'm not doing a whole lot of business in this city. So, you know, I can't say what, what the issues are that people, you know, don't like him. But you, guess what? New York has, it, it might as well have been an earthquake. It might as well have been the same type of earthquake that happened 10 years ago in Japan. It might have been, it's, that's the same kind of thing that happened business-wise here. It's been a year. It's been it's, oh, as of as of the third. That's when they shut down the city. It's been a year since New York City. Oh, it's been a year down. so far. Yeah, I think with us, it's around the teens mm -hmm. in California. Yeah, I had a yeah. car accident just before, so I can right. always measure it by the car accident, but I don't right. have the date anymore. But right. I got right. emails right. to settle the insurance and stuff. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. But it was literally the week, the weekend before. Yeah. So for us, it's March too. Right, right. So now there, he's he's about to open up. Uh, he, he, I, I just saw it this. I watched this morning. Uh, they are opening up commercial, you know, arts and entertainment venues. Uh, I believe it is uh, not not fifty percent. I think twenty five percent or something like that. Thirty three percent, something like that. But. Geo, I can mm -hmm. agree with you, mm -hmm. actually, that the queen mm -hmm. is not racist. I'm just talking about the queen. Who I understand. The crown. Right, who right. The crown. Right. That's because why I say that the I chart is representing, you. her chart is representing Britain or the royal family as a whole. Yes, I can agree with you mm -hmm. because this is the same treatment. Mm -hmm. that was given to Diana. It's not much different. Right, right. And that had nothing to do with racism. This mm -hmm. has everything to do with the crown being compromised. Now, with that being said, I think racism plays a part. Yes, yes. 
with yes. others in the firm. Definitely, definitely. Some Racism, of them don't even hide it. <laughs> and some of them can't even hide it. Yeah. There was that one woman that wore that slavery pin. Oh yeah, that's when right. It. That's. I was like, she tried it. She tried it out, and she did it. And she's proud of her pin. It's just mean. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. and that's racism. And I'm mm -hmm. not sure. Mm -hmm. yet, I think William and Kate are complicit. And that's why the boys don't get along now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because you're my brother. Mm -hmm. You know what's happening and you know what happened to my mother. Our mother. Our mother. That's right. How could you forget? Mm -hmm. Harry doesn't want a repeat of his mother. It broke him. Mm -hmm. It broke Harry. Mm -hmm. William mm -hmm. is like the grandmother. The queen. Stood the queen. Mentally. You gotta say the queen. Yes. The queen. The queen. Yes. He stood <laughs> mentally with yeah. the crown. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not that I'm saying he didn't feel anything. Right. But right. Harry. He may have had, he's, he's had to push past it in like yes. you know, when they tell you, man up, you gotta, you know, tragedies happen in your life. You gotta, because you're gonna be the king. That's what I believe they said to him. You're gonna be the king. So, right. And Harry always mm -hmm. knew he was never going to. The, 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 the one that's not going to be the king is always the troublemaker, king or queen. Mm -hmm. exactly. Look at the queen's sister, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they're mm -hmm. feeling. The ones mm -hmm. that are underneath, they yeah. heart feels, yeah. feels for others, feels mm -hmm. for the country. The, the only feeling. one where it was switched around was Queen Elizabeth's father and the brother. The brother yeah. was the one, the one who was supposed to be king his name was David, and he became yeah, King yeah, Edward. Yeah. He was the one. Who, he was more modern. He didn't. Yeah. He wanted to change he had a his good soul. Uh, uh, he started hanging out with Hitler. Sorry. Oh, I that's remember why, that. That's, that's the real reason why they had him abdicate. Everybody, they they made up this romantic story. He wanted to be with his with with Wallace, the love of his life. That was not it. Wake up, people. Ironically, ironically, <laughs> they're German. He went to, if, if, even if it was Hitler, he went to mm -hmm. hang out with his peoples, even if it was Hitler, mm -hmm. because they're German. They changed their name to get away from the history that German was providing. Yes, their names. They were the Habsburgs. Yeah. Goth the house from the house of Gotha Cobalt. Got half the cleft of that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Saxa Coburg Gotha. That's right. So um, yes. We got way off target, but I would love to discuss this. Maybe next week because by Sunday it would have come yes. out. Yes. There would be a lot of things coming mm -hmm. out from the media from over there, over here. The real problem, yeah, the real cover up here is Prince Andrew. That's the UK cover up. The UK doesn't even want to allow mm -hmm. a pedophile. The UK, the media, I'm not even talking about the crown. Right. They won't even let a real alleged pedophile take his natural order and, I mean, we got to talk about that. Because I feel like Megan and Harry mm -hmm. are covering up the bigger steam here. There's a whole tornado back here. Nobody wants to deal with it. A whole, a whole tornado. <laughs> a whole, you know, but I don't even want a whole A Megan, tornado. <laughs> Megan, Megan. And how easy it is for women right. to hate women. How easy it is. Mm -hmm. It's so easy for women to hate women. Mm -hmm. It's also so easy for mm -hmm. men to attack women. Mm -hmm. It's so easy. For women not to protect women when a man is attacking a woman, 
they're not even going after Harry. Crazy, they're going after to, Megan. Right, right. I wanted to ask you what your sense is about Kate and this Buckingham Palace thing. Um, I like to do a reading on that, but I'll tell you what I, I think I saw. I remember you did a reading at some yeah. point that you said, and I'm wondering if this is it. In your reading, you said, Kate is going to do something. You said, Kate is going to do something that could ruin the way the royal family. You basically said it could tear the whole thing. And I remember you kind of saying, Kate, don't do it. Kate, this sounds like it. This this harassment, bullying thing at Buckingham Palace. I'm like, it could you know, come the out. Queen, Queen is too busy. She ain't. She don't even care about Buckingham Palace anymore. She's never going and back. And her husband's in the hospital now. She's yes. too old. I really right. feel like mm -hmm. this attack on Meghan. I really mm -hmm. feel like it's not even the Queen. Right. If right. you look at most of the directives that were given to the Queen, yes, it didn't come from her. Right. I feel like they're saying to her, you're too old to deal with it. So mm -hmm. this is how we're going to handle it. And I feel like because she doesn't know social media, right. that she didn't know most of the thing that she, things that she was governing. Right. She learned along the way. Again, social media is here. Right. And she's having to learn it, but she's also too old to learn it. Right. Right. And I feel like they're saying we need to put out this campaign. And I feel like she's like, okay. Mm -hmm. Not that she's being a bad person. I think she's like, okay. The castle can't stand. The castle can't stand. Hmm. Uranus and Taurus. Uh, oh, it cannot God. stand. Ooh, wow. The castle can't stand. And the only one that might have had some insight about that is Megan. I think Megan is a metaphysical person. Yes, I she think is. she's had charts done. Yes, yes. I think she's had insight. Mm -hmm. I think she studied all of this. Let's not forget her mom. Her mom. What do you mean by that? Help me. Her mom is a yoga a yoga um instructor so you she's in our we, world yes yes i think megan's exit had everything to do with knowing it can't stand mm -hmm. it's not going to be there for william and kate because it can't be so with that being said i would love to do a chart on kate and Megan, or maybe just Kate. Maybe Kate and Megan. Because these two are so I'm weird. I'm trying to figure out how brave I am. I'm sitting up here, yeah. And boy, family got guns. Like, oh, yeah. But you might be able to see in her chart whether yes. or not the crown stands. But I mm -hmm. believe mm -hmm. Kate. Uh, Megan with her Uranus may have brought chaos, but chaos is what Uranus does. Mm -hmm. And it's a beautiful thing. Chaos is a beautiful thing mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when all is said and done because it mm -hmm. creates positive change. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. um, I think, you know, I think, it'll, I think it'll stand, but we're going to see more chaos. And what the chaos I think is going to be, I, you know, I, I don't wish this on anybody. I don't wish this on the queen or anything, but so, let's say within... Uh, Uranus is going to be in Taurus. I think for another. It's going to be in, in Taurus for a, a total of six years, I believe. Um, at some point, um, God forbid, you know, the Queen. She's going to be around for a while. She'll be around. They live a long time. But whatever happens, whether whether Charles becomes king or whether she finally says, you know what, we need somebody else to step in. Mm -hmm. Charles was not, Charles, there, there's certain signatures in a person's chart when you're born a king. Elizabeth has it, William has it, Charles mm. doesn't have it. So what mm. the chaos may be, it may be the same kind of thing of how, how Elizabeth at the beginning of her life, 
she wasn't supposed to be the queen. She became queen only because King David mm -hmm. abdicated and her brother mm -hmm. then switched over. Mm -hmm. Took over. Mm -hmm. Took over. And then uh, her father became the king, which put her in the direct line. Now she's going to be, she was just supposed to be a little princess girl for the rest of her life. No, she became the queen. Now that for the end of her reign, when her aim, reign ends, no matter how it ends, it's going to be the same on the other end of her reign. And that's going to be, there's going to be a, a, a mix up, a trip up. Either Charles will become king just because of his birth, but he may not be coronated, just like David was never coronated. I can see that. Right. I can see that. Coronated. So I can see that happening, that he will have to shift, because Charles is not looking good these days. They even will blame it on Here's his the thing. Heart. Well, I was going to say that COVID yeah. is still running rampant. So we don't know any of this and I'm not killing anyone. So relax. Yeah, people. I'm not even right. But here's, here's, here's what I like to offer up. Mm -hmm. Even if William becomes king mm -hmm. by the end of Uranus, mm. after the end, after the end of Uranus, mm -hmm. there's, they're going to be ordinary Joes. Yeah. They have to be. This isn't working. This this queendom is not working. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So even if he becomes king, it gets reduced to where he's a commoner. It's practically that now. I agree, but I'm mm -hmm. saying by the end of Uranus right. and Taurus, mm -hmm. then it that that's what it's going to be, mm -hmm. and rightfully so. The mm -hmm. prime minister should be mm -hmm. in charge of the damn country. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It should not be shared. Mm -hmm. And too much money, too much money is mm -hmm. going over to mm -hmm. the royal family. Mm -hmm. And COVID is depleting funds. So it's going to come down to, you know, title, title mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. only not the whole pomp and circumstance anymore. I just don't think there's going to be enough money to carry them. You're still getting their same thing. How do you I carry think, them and the mm -hmm. people? Yeah, I'm still getting the I same think thing. I, yeah. saw, I read something where, like, what is it, like seven cents out of everybody's taxes in the British Empire, at least in Britain, seven cents goes to the royal family, goes yep. to the queen. Um and so they say, you know, that's mm -hmm. not such a that's not such a big bill, you know, to have your you know to have your. Queen. But it is. I don't, I, I don't know. And, but you also have to remember, this royal family also, has been Gio, through. They, Gio, wait, so let, me, also, let me just fin let me just finish this sentence. Yeah. They they've been okay. through Uranus ahead, going through ahead. Taurus every eighty four years for over a thousand years now. So I'm not a hundred percent sure. Okay. Yeah. That, they, that, that it'll bring them totally down to the ground, at least maybe not William, maybe it will. his son. It you will. Think his son will I, get, listen, yeah. listen, I'm, listen, listen to me. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying he won't be king. Right, right, right. I'm not right. saying that. I'm yeah. saying the royal can't stand, the crown can't stand. Right, right, right. And I'm going to tell you something else. Mm -hmm. The UK owns mm -hmm the most amount of countries owns them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They can't keep all those countries. Mm -hmm. People right. wanna, they wanna leave the confines of the yeah. queen, especially the Caribbean countries. Yeah, so not only, yeah. mm -hmm. not only can the, can the crown not stand the way it stands today. Oh, King William. No, if anything, I promise you, his name's going to be William, Will. Mm -hmm. Like all of that has to change because it's Uranus mm -hmm. and Taurus. Not only that, countries are going to leave. There was one country already that wrote a letter to the Queen and was like, "We're leaving." One of the Caribbean countries. Saint yeah, Kitts that's or what something. I was going to say. Yeah, yeah. One of the, uh, yeah, yeah. One of them just right? left. They're gonna, they, so they're gonna lose their playground. Mm -hmm. They're gonna lose their ownership. They're gonna lose, like. Yeah. But, but in a weird kind of way, they should. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They didn't take care of South Africa. Right. 
They didn't. Apartheid my ass. It was a joke. Do you understand? Yeah. Oh, South Africa's free. They were never free. They're not free today. And there's missing children, black women in South Africa. Somebody has to pay for that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not that William should be the one paying for it. But the crown? Mm -mm. Nope. Crown can't stand. So it's kind of like, hey, Kate, you're going to get what you want. I wonder what that looks like. As you don't have the funds to buy beautiful dresses. As you remember, COVID is the beginning. As yeah, you can't right, go right. out and, and go to uh, charities and balls and stuff, it's already starting. Mm -hmm. The what Kate's going to get? Good luck with that. Because when you get hungry people, hungry people, they're not going to be like, Queen Kate. Everything has to change. They might get the title initially. Oh, she's queen. And people are going to be like, ah. It's a different generation, Gio. Mm -hmm. By the time yeah, Kate yeah. gets the crown, it's mm -hmm. a totally different generation. Mm -hmm. We are, none of us are going to care. Mm -hmm. Right now, we like Megan. And what did they do to Megan? They took the crown away. Really, Kate? You think you're going to be able to keep your crown in your tatted clothing? Interesting. I'd like to see what that looks like. Mark my words. I might not see it for seven years. What happened with Woody, Gio? Mm -hmm. What All happened right. with Woody Allen? Seven well, years. Seven years. Mm -hmm. We might yeah. not see it for seven years, but mm -hmm. they can't keep that crown. They're not they even taking that. care of the countries that they're responsible for. Right. That's another thing that bringing up, uh, bringing up Kate and the Queen didn't like Kate. Do you, do you remember this when it first, when they first started getting together? No. <laughs> she liked Megan better than she liked Kate. Kate had family members. I believe it. Megan is so endearing. Kate had, well, you know, Kate is endearing too, but it was the, it was that that judgment again of her family. She had she had that or she had drunk uncle who liked to go to the clubs and, and, and he wanted to sell, you know, oh I'm Kate's uncle. Gio. Hey. Yeah. Gio. Uh -oh. Hello, hello, Four, hello. Four hundred four hundred and seventy five million dollars. Mm -hmm. They make from the citizens uh, the surrounding surrounding yeah. I believe it's all the countries. Four hundred and seventy five million yes. dollars. That needs to stop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I agree. I agree. And, and somebody because else put it's... we're in a five year change. Somebody put we're in a five year change. And somebody agreed with you. The queen didn't like Kate for a long time. Interesting. Right. Because mm -hmm. of Kate's family. Uh, um, and there was also an incident that I didn't know about this. So her mother owns a business. Um, her mother owns a business that is um, it, it's it's like a party a, a party store party. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, you know, got it, got it. Yeah. Uh -huh. And they were uh -huh. selling a costume. Now this could be hearsay. This could be hearsay. Okay. We'll have Say to, the people, the uh -huh. British people will have to tell us if it's true. That they were at some point uh, around Halloween, they were selling a costume amidst all their costumes, a costume that was um, Diana after the accident. Halloween. Oh, that's terrible. I don't want to hear that. That's disgusting. Right, right. So it that, got, that's that karma. That's yeah. karma. Good luck with that, Kate's mm, mother. Mm, mm. Okay, Gio, I have to go. Did you okay. say everything to the people? I said, yeah, pretty much, pretty much said everything, and uh, that, uh, that, yeah, okay. I just said, royal family don't want the smoke. They don't want this smoke. They don't want this smoke. It's going to be beautiful. Watch it Sunday, guys. If you want to watch it with me, we're going to be on Periscope. I'll figure out if it comes early. If not, it'll, I'll watch it at 8 o'clock Pacific. Right. 8 o'clock Pacific. Yeah. Yes. But either way, we on it. Yes, yes. Sunday, watch it with me. 
Girls and Geo, guys, once again, go to you. Tracy Brown Live. Girls and guys, go to Tracy Brown Live. Girls wait, and wait, 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 Geo, Geo, oh. Geo, how can they reach you? How oh, they can, can they reach you? you? Because you are amazing. Uh, if you need a, an astrological consultation, which is a reading, um, go to my, uh, you know, contact me on my uh, email address, which is geocosmicvalentine at yahoo.com. You can also check me out on uh, Instagram, which is at geovalentine on Instagram. So, but I'll get yes. your message faster with the email. Geo. Bye. Yes. Bye, guys. Love you, Gio. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. you. We Thank might have you. to do a follow up. We might have to do a follow up I'm into next it. Friday. Into it. Yes. Okay. All right. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye. Hi, this is Tracy. Hold on a second. I'm just going to turn you up. What's your name? Okay. What's your name? Felicia Robinson. Yes, yes, Felicia. How are you? Before we get started, where did you pay? Um, Cash App. Okay. So tell me what's going on. I'm going to send you a heart from Cash App. Okay. What's going on? Okay, nothing specific then, nothing specific. You have an opportunity to dig into something very, very specific. Would you like to? Is there anything specific? 